Assalamu alaikum everyone. I hope you all are fine. We'll start second chapter today which is natural numbers and whole numbers. And in this video we are going to discuss decimal system, face value and place value and expanded notation. Let's get started. Decimal system. The most common system of numeration is the Arabic system which uses only 10 symbols namely 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 and 9. These symbols are called digit. These are 10 digits from 0 to 9. So this system is called decimal system. Okay, so this is how it is written in Pakistani, uh, Pakistani way and this is how it is written in international way. In Pakistani system we start from units, tens, hundreds, thousands, ten thousands, lakhs, ten lakhs, crore. 10 crore Arab and in international system unit 10 hundred thousand 10 thousand hundred thousand then millions 10 millions and hundred millions and billions okay so in Pakistani system the numbers are arranged in first in unit group then in thousand group then in lakhs and then crores and then Arab but international system first is unit group then thousands then millions and then billions so here numbers are first arranged in the digit of first group is of digit three digits but the next one is of two two digit and in international system all the groups are of three digits you know ten hundred then thousand uh, thousand is of three digit million hundred million then billion is again of three digits so now we'll see that how we can write the number in this system let's consider an example Look at this eight digit number. Now we'll write this number according to Pakistani system and international system. First we will see how can we write this number by giving correct spaces or by putting correct commas. Okay, so one, five, seven, six, three, one, four, five. So let's write the places first. Unit ten hundred thousand ten thousand lakh ten lakh and this is uh, how uh, we can write the names in uh, Pakistani system now first comma will come here because it's first group unit group then this one is thousand groups second comma here thousands group then lakh so comma here so this is how we write number in Pakistani system and now we'll write this in international system international system it will be unit 10 hundred thousand ten thousand hundred thousand then million and ten million so now the first group is unit group is here and then thousand group and then million group so we put comma after three digits in international system first rule and second so now we will write these numbers in words uh, this will be written in words as 1 crore, then lakh group, 57 lakh, 63,145. And this will be written as, this is millions group, so we'll combine these two numbers, 15 million. Then this is whole as thousand group, so we'll combine these three digits, 763,000, then 145. So this is how it will be written as in Pakistani system and international system. In Pakistani system, one crore fifty-seven lakh sixty-three thousand one hundred forty-five, and international system, fifteen million seven hundred sixty-three thousand one hundred forty-five. Now. Face value and place value. Okay, face value of particular digit in a given number is the long number represented by the dead digit irrespective of its place in the number. It means that face value is just the actual value of that digit. For example, 5, 2, 6, 4. We have to write the place value of 4 in this number. And 5, 2, 4, 6 or 5, 4, 2, 6. Now we have to write the face value of 4 in each number, 4. So what will be the face value of digit 4 in each number? It will be just 4. 
no matter what is its place in each number here it is at hundreds place here it is at tens place and here it is at units place but while writing face value we just write the actual value of that digit which is 4 okay and the place value is the value of each digit in a number its value depends on where it is in the number face a place value is based on the position of that digit in a number for example if we have to write the place value of uh, the example already written here place value of 4 now we have to write the place value of 4 in each number so what will be the place value of 4 here here 4 is at units place so the place value will be 4 or we can also write 4 units then what will be the place value of 4 here here 4 is at tens place so we'll write 40 or we can also write 4 tens these are two ways of writing place value and here 4 is at hundreds place so its place value will be 400 or 4 hundreds in words so this this is the difference between face value and place value face value is just the value actual value of that digit and place value depends on its position in the number okay now expanded notation in expanded notation the place values of a digits in number are written in descending order using plus signs between them for example we have to write this number in expanded form okay so we write the place values of digits what is the place value of this digit unit 10 hundred thousand and 10,000 so it's 50,000 so we'll write how many digits are after 5? 4. So we put 4 zeros here. Now we will write the place value of digit 8 which is 8000. Now we will write the place value of digit 7 which is 700. And now 6 which is 60 and then 2. So this is our number is written in expanded form. Let's consider one more example of expanded notation. Okay, the next example is 2005. Now we have to write this number in expanded forms. First, we will write the place value of 2, which is 2000. Then we will write 0, 0, 0, and 5. We can also put just one 0 instead of this if the, we have to write the place value of 0 in the digit. So, this is how the expanded notation in expanded notation numbers are written so i hope that everything is clear now if you have any question then you can contact on school's contact number thank you allah face